Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome. My name is Stephanie. Today's video is so exciting, you guys. I'm going to be showing you guys how to do a DIY wall art that, I mean, you can do this at your house for cheap. I mean, the most I spent for this was probably like 15 bucks. Anyway, without further ado, let's get to it. First thing you're going to need are some canvas. I'm using three today. And then also choose whatever painting colors you want. I go more towards the nude colors. Those are the colors I'm going with. And then also have Sharpie in hand and also a lead pencil and of course some tape as well. And then also have some brushes and some water. I'm going to start by using this white paint base coat and I'm using a candle cap. I did not have anything else to put the paint in. You can use whatever you want. I'm just using this for this video. But all you're going to be doing is basically painting the entire canvas white to get that smooth look. And then afterwards you're going to go ahead and put tape on the edges of the canvas. of whatever you want to be on the wall art that you're doing. Today I'm going with this one and the pot with the plants and then also the leaves. Now I'm going to be taking this gooey marshmallow paint color and the snuggly teddy bear paint color and all I'm going to be doing is mixing these two together to create a nude color that is super beautiful. It's not going to be too light or too dark. It's like the perfect nude tone and you guys will get to see that. But of course you guys can choose whatever colors you want. done mixing the colors together you're gonna go ahead and paint the remaining of the canvas whatever colors you chose and just paint it all away so for my liking it was a little bit too dark so I went ahead and added a little bit more of the gooey marshmallow paint color just so it can create a little bit of a lighter tone but um, that's pretty much all you do and now you set it out to dry and you start with the next one for the last two canvases i did it a little bit different i did not paint them fully white at the beginning i just pretty much put the tape on the edges and then just painted the remaining of the canvas the paint color that i went with now you're going to choose whatever art you want to do i'm going to start with this one so you are going to start sketching it with a lead pencil now make sure that the canvas is completely dry otherwise it's going to be a mess and it's going to be a little bit difficult to have to redo it again so once you are done doing it with a mechanical pencil you're going to go ahead and go over it with your sharpie and it's that easy guys <music> the tape out but you really want to be careful because you can tear off the paint as well so kind of hold the paint down and then tear the tape slowly and there you got it now we're gonna go ahead and start with the next one and I'm gonna go on with these leaves so let's start sketching these leaves were probably the easiest ones out of the three that I chose so it's kind of like a easy fast process but I just took the same sharpie and just pretty much repeat the same process for all of them you guys okay guys for this one it was a little bit more difficult because I kept messing up the vase and it was so annoying but I got it at the end and this one was a little bit easy but the only problem was the vase because I couldn't get it to the right shape but I finally got it and I'm just gonna do the little flower the stem and then I added like a little like a water kind of effect on the bottom of the vase and that looked super cute I was so obsessed with this one <music> So these 
these were all the wall arts that I did. I am so happy with how they turned out, honestly. They couldn't have turned out better. I absolutely love them. Honestly, very cheap as well. So I would definitely recommend you do this if you don't want to go out and spend so much money on wall decor and all of that stuff. So definitely recommend this if you're on a budget like me. That was it for today's video. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget to hit that like button. And also, don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you would like to join the family. Thank you guys for spending time with me. I really hope you have a wonderful day and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye! Also, Milo is like in need of something right now. Let me go get him.